6 Personal Defense Network training tour, and here's our update. I'm in Camden, Tennessee today, and this is actually the map wall at the infamous team room here at Tactical Response. James Yeager is hosting me here in Middle Tennessee for four days of training, combat-focused shooting, advanced pistol handling, and some combat-focused carbine. We're going to break out the Daniel Defense rifles on Thursday and do some shooting with the students. We'll make sure we get some footage in the next week's update. There'll also be some footage from conversations that James and I are having during the week, and you get to see some pictures from the class. Of course, you can check out our Facebook page for combat focus shooting, you'll be able to see those as well. Also, as far as Facebook pages go, Personal Defense Network's Facebook page got over 5,000 likes on the like mark as of last week. So if you haven't been over there, you haven't checked out what we're doing, what we're talking about, we've always got some great conversations, putting out questions, asking you your opinions, and of course asking you what you want to hear in the videos from Personal Defense Network or what you'd like to see our contributors write articles about. So if you haven't liked our page, go on over there. In fact, you may as well take 10, 15 minutes, check out all of our sponsors' Facebook pages, check out all of our instructors' Facebook pages, our host venues, just get out there on Facebook and really see what's going on in the Personal Defense Network community. Meanwhile, I've started the last big leg of the tour for me. From here, it's completely westward. I head out to Seattle, of course. It's for the end of the tour in mid-July. So for two months, I'm on the road. My first leg of the tour was up the East Coast. Then I was actually based in Ohio, where I'm headquartered for a couple weeks. I was teaching there, and you've seen some footage from there and heard from some of those students and some of the other guys that were teaching some of the host venues. And then, of course, I was up in New England at one point. And this last week, I was actually down in Florida with one of our PDN tour sponsors, Mark Craighead of Crossbreed Holsters. I was invited to shoot on the Crossbreed Holsters team at the Shooting with Soft event, which was really great. It was a great fundraiser. We were actually teamed up with an Army Special Forces Master Sergeant, and three of us shot with him. Um, we shot three stages. There were about 125 competitors. I don't do a lot of competitive shooting, but it was a lot of fun. And, of course, we raised money for a good cause, and there was a good party afterwards and everything else, everything you wanted, a good charity fundraising event. We're continuing on. I've got about 20 some odd classes left, several more stops, our other instructors are still busy, and there's even a couple of instructors we haven't heard from yet this year on the tour. You're going to get to hear from them in future updates. Keep an eye on us, visit us at personaldefensenetwork.com, take a few minutes to check out those Facebook pages, and again, be sure to thank our sponsors for supporting the Personal Defense Network tour. At Crossbreed Holsters, basically, we concentrate on holsters and good equipment for concealed carry. Uh, not doing too much in the tactical market, but basically we concentrate on equipping either the uh, licensed CCW civilian or the off-duty or undercover operator in having the best gear possible to conceal their weapon, keep it comfortable and with them at all times. And we're getting pretty popular. We've had a lot of growth in the past four or five years. We've changed the industry in some significant ways, and we are the home of the world-famous Super Tuck. You can check us out at www.crossbreedholsters. And today, we're in Tampa, Florida at the Shooting with Special Forces event. It's the first annual event that brings Special Forces operators and business leaders together uh, to meld their skills so they can learn from each other and move forward with partnerships and networking. 